On Palm Sunday, Jesus entered Jerusalem with his disciples, riding a borrowed donkey. He arrived to much celebration, but it was the beginning of the end of his human life. Luke chapter 19, verses 37 to 40. As he was drawing near, already on the way down the Mount of Olives, the whole multitude of his disciples began to rejoice and praise God with a loud voice for all the mighty works they had seen, saying, Blessed is the King who comes in the name of the Lord. Peace in heaven, glory in the highest. And some of the Pharisees in the crowd said to him, Teacher, rebuke your disciples. He answered, I tell you, if these were silent, the very stones would cry out. I might as well be talking to the wall. I hear that phrase quite often in our house. I'm engrossed in some trivia and Janice is trying to tell me something important. Everything else might be just background noise, but it's peculiar how those words, I might as well be talking to the wall, suddenly bring me back to reality. Jesus was wanting to bring the Pharisees back to reality. The people were praising, but all the Pharisees heard was background noise. Stop the noise, they cried. Jesus replied, I tell you, if they keep quiet, the stones will cry out. It was more likely that the impossible would happen, that stones would sing, than that the King of Kings would enter his capital city without honour. Listen, what God has said, he will do. What he has planned, he will accomplish. What he has promised, he will bring to pass. And nothing, nothing can stop him.